gotta heist these up a little bit more. Competitive nature right. just stems out of you. Right. So that's what that is. I know you wouldn't get it because you haven't trained in the martial arts like I have. It. Yeah. So when people see me in the streets like this, they know to stay away. Can you give me another spot, please? Uh. What the hell? I didn't see how this video going. What is your brother to you? No, we just carry ourselves the same way. Exactly. <laughs> But these ain't ripping no time, so that me constantly stuffing them. So as the fabric inside gets more compressed, the body gets a bit denser, and we're able to put more in. They actually do for the stuffing, actually. Welcome back to Never Have I Ever, where we kick gum and chew ass. Today we will be challenging Mo Fire Bahamas. Yeah. Now I don't know if you know, your boy used to do kung fu back in the day. Didn't know that. I was a little too good at it. Now, how practical kung fu is when dudes them just have guns? I don't know. Plus, when you're doing like the horse stance, you gotta look a little cooler than that. I'm looking to modify my tools of violence, and we will be learning some Muay Thai moves and doing some intense light light sparring. Light sparring. Solid. Please. That was pretty good. Come straight into the land. <laughs> The real shit, motherfucker. It's giving uh. SpongeBob. Like against Sandy. <laughs> I got a camera rolling. Oh, sorry. You're good, you're good, you're good. Y'all know me by now. If y'all don't, shame on all of you. This is Giovanni Mofia Johnson. I keep looking into this thinking no as a worries. camera. <laughs> I started off with kickboxing, Sanda, which is Chinese kickboxing, Dutch kickboxing, and that led me to Thailand. The mecca of Muay Thai. I was one of the do martial arts, but typical Bayman parents, very yes. strict, very protective. Yes. You can't do that. That no, 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 no sense. Enough of all this talky talking. Why don't you show me some Muay Thai moves? The only things that really set Muay Thai apart from, say, kickboxing would be the emphasis on flinch, which would be here. I see this a lot. And then here. the knee would come up. And it would shut. Oh! Yeah, so it's a, it's a lot. And of course, your elbows. Mm -hmm. Elbows are fight stoppers, especially if you cut a person open. You see those a lot. <laughs> you don't see much crisp boxing in Muay Thai, but you do see a lot of heavy kicks. Arm breaking, knee breaking, yeah. kicks. Push kick, your teeth, as we call it. Pretty much a uh, stay away strike. Oy. Pretend you're kicking out a door. Up and out. Boom. Now put your hips behind it. There we go. Don't push yourself backwards. Okay. <laughs> I almost got fired. That's better. Oh, no. I almost smashed my toe. Yep. Good. And then you have your roundhouse. <laughs> so it's all about drive. It seems like you whip in it. Yes. The force of a bat, but you want the speed of a whip. Oh. Step into your kick. Yes. Mm -hmm. Right there. Hands up. Step out. One, two, three. Don't be scared to hit the vibe. Boom. Baby shins. Kick through the vibe. Step out and kick. Boom. A little bit better. I was scared to hit it. Just I know. You sure I can break my shin, but I'm pretty sure. Can't be 100%, but. Pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. When you land, I'm trying to stop the fight. So I'm trying to literally not, not end point this point. man's life, but. Wink, wink, nice, nice. Yes. Don't. You gotta bruise somebody. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Baby chins, baby chins. Because you step in, into the bike and out, get in your shin heel. Also, the higher up you get, the softer the bike. Oh, thanks. Just like the softest part of the bike right here, this is the hardest. I appreciate that, man. Because everything is cool. That's cool. <laughs> Man, but then again, like, you either uh, bruise your shin or you tear a muscle because you're not flexible. See? It's also true. Exactly. Face me. All right, control, kick. Bang. Your knee needs to face this way. Feel that resistance? Turn your heel to me. And that allows you to turn. That's how you want to feel. Sparring is a learning experience. You're not getting paid, I'm not getting paid. Right. So I'm not trying to hurt you. Right. Since you are a replacement for that body. Okay, you can punch by, you can kick by, you can move, you make it hard for me to hit you. 
I'm not throwing heavy strikes. I'm not throwing heavy kicks. I'm literally trying to learn as much from this as I can. If you hit me, that shows me that I'm not, I'm not fast enough. I'm not moving my head enough, or I'm not using my footwork. In high gyms, a lot of sparring, a lot of laughing, because they see his play. Otherwise, you get any feelings because you get hit in the nose. <laughs> this right here. Uh, don't be scary. <laughs> yeah, throw it. I'm not to turn the back in <laughs> The condition and difference. <laughs> Cause you're doing all the work. I'm just looking for openings. If I see my opponents getting the better of me, I say, what is he doing that I'm not? I'm not moving at all. I'm just right here. You are, you're exerting a lot of energy. Here, I can see you and I can react. My hands are up, my chin is down. So if you throw something, I can see it. And don't punch my gloves, aim for my face. All right, good, boom. Yeah, exactly, calm movement down, find rhythm, and cross your feet. Good. Beat it. Don't yourself into the corner. Good? Don't I? There's still a lot of Kung Fu in you. It's not bad. Kung Fu is very practical. We're outside of this. In the ring, you have to change it. So Kung Fu has a practical combat system. The sand up. It gets rid of flowery movements. It looks more like kickboxing. I'm always in my stance. My Solid feet. stance. Exactly. I don't let my feet cross because now my balance is... Cross stuff. Even when I change angle, I'm here. Always. So how can people reach out to you, Mo? Oh, well, you know, I have my own studio right now. Me and Sherwood Drummond. And we're off of Bernard Road. You can hit up Instagram, Mama Studios. Mama, yes. M-A, M-A Studios. You could WhatsApp me at 801-5815 for classes, or you just hit me up on Messenger. It was a good battle. I kept you on your toes. Yes, you did. Kept you moving. Yes, you did. Some punches, you got it. I'll give you that. Thank you, sir Mo Fire. <laughs> Never have I ever been a Muay Thai fighter. Done. <laughs> <laughs>